Hello, this is Ubuntu Problems. In this video, I quickly resolve an issue I had with my Epson XP200 scanner. I installed Etsane version 0.999 by Oliver Rauch. When I tried to start the software, it would literally take five minutes to find my scanner. Now it only takes a few seconds. As you can see, there we are. So to resolve this problem, first we need to go to where the Etsane configuration files are stored. So the best way to do this is to go into a terminal and we just type in sudo nautilus. And the reason we use sudo is we need root access to be able to edit those configuration files for the Etsane scanner. So we now click on computer, go to the etc directory, and then look for sane.d directory. So the first thing I did was create an other scanner conf file and pretty much moved all the configuration files that did not pertain to the Epson scanner. So if we double click on that we can see there's a scanner file uh, configuration files for other devices like Canon, Fujitsu and so on. The next thing we need to do is to edit the dll.conf file, this one here. And we need to edit out pretty much all the devices that are listed here. As the problem is that when you start it saying, it will actually go through all these devices looking for a scanner. So we just leave Epson uncommented. and also NET, which I think will look for a wireless device, a wireless Epson device. The second thing we need to do is to edit the actual configuration file for the Epson scanner, and that is called epkowa.conf. We'll double click on that. So we need to just keep the USB uncommented, but comment out the SCSI uh, device uh, entry as we do not have any SCSI devices. You could also specify the location, but if you do that, then it will actually bring up two choices which are the same. So you just need USB. And that's about it. So you can edit these files and then you save them. So if you liked this video, give me a thumbs up. If you disliked it, give me a thumbs down. And if you really like this uh, channel, please subscribe. Thank you very much.